Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Once again, I'm Nev from Nev's Tech, but today we're going to be taking a look on a Lenovo M725S. My 5s and my S's look a lot alike, don't they, ladies and gentlemen? So, as soon as we open or take a look, we can see we got four USBs on the front, two USB 3.0, two USB uh, 1.0 or 2.0. I'm not sure, probably 2.0. Anyways, we got uh, headset, microphone, not headset, sorry. Uh, I guess headset, whatever. Anyways, take a look at the back. We got one, two, display, one, two, three, four USBs. That should keep you well enough. And then we get uh, VGA, serial. I know a lot of people don't use serial, but some of us actually do. And then we got the power, of course, low pro profile case. Let me open the sucker up and see what's on the inside. In here, we can see we got a Ryzen. Wait, is that a full? Jeez, I'm amazed. PCI Express. And then uh, the mini. CPU down there, uh, M2 card, and yeah, like usually just pop this off, this thing flies up, and you got to make sure you get a very small video card if you want to be using one of these things. 8 gigs RAM in there, and uh, I think we have a Ryzen 5 in here, let's get her fired up and we'll have a look. Alright, so getting her turned on, having a look, we got 8 gigs of RAM, we got 8 cores, AMD Ryzen 5 Pro. And the video card is an AMD Ryzen Vega 11 graphics. So last time I compared a Ryzen 5 to a Ryzen 3, I wasn't too happy with the benchmark results. But uh, let's try it again. We'll see what we get. All right. So this is the, once again, this is the M725S. The M720 got a benchmark of 4,000, above 4,000. I expect this one to do better. All right, first video test, and honestly, I am pleased. Let me knock this up just a little bit so you can see. Big 11 graphics. I have difficulty with this one on other systems, on some other systems. Man, those planes are really flying beautifully, though. Next up, we get the floating rocks. Here we go, DirectX 10. Okay, that's about standard from what I normally see, about 8 frames per second. I don't know why. DirectX 10. Maybe it's an older standard or something. Actually, if anyone could explain that to me, why this doesn't run on a newer system, but it'll run on an older one. Interesting, it slows down when it's zoomed in, but when it scrolls out, maybe the detail fades away. And next up, I believe, is DirectX 12. Looking good, Space Squid. Sorry, this is DirectX 12. That looks nice. That's smooth. Oh wow, okay, normally I don't record this, but it's going through it so quick and nicely that I can't not. Look at that, jeez, that's something. All right, so that's not the score that I was expecting to see, but it works, it works. Um, yeah, I guess it's cheaper than the Intel. That's about it for me, Net from Nestec. That's like and subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. Always appreciate it, and uh, have a good one, folks. Take it easy.